Well, we haven't built a refinery for the last 40 years in this country, and certainly the Yuma community and having served there again as their state senator um, supported it strongly. And unfortunately, like you said, the funding wasn't there, and uh, we, we haven't seen it being built. But it really raised a lot of hope for a lot of people out there. We met with the, the backers of the Yuma Refinery, and the project to me always seemed uh, much more speculative than it was viable. Uh, the plan was to get crude oil from Mexico, run a pipeline, it would end up in Yuma, it would cost billions of dollars, there was no financing, but it was a wonderful idea. Then the reason I think the refinery isn't built right now is because of the financial issues, putting together the investment group to do something like that. The fundamental issue continues to be for that project is the fact, do you have a supply of crude for refining purposes and do you have the financing for the construction and startup of the company and the pipeline to bring that crude to that? And the answer at this point is either no or no answer at all. So I think it's speculative. I think it's a little bit pie in the sky. Uh, and before we invest a lot of energy, time, federal money into a project that's at this point is speculative, I think that would be a waste of time and money.